Hello and welcome back to Road Trippia, the once a day road trip trivia quiz. Today's episode is day 106 of the 365 day trivia road trip. It is a pit stop. The pit stop trivia has shorter questions. The answers come faster. The name of the game today is speed. We're in, we're out, we're back on with regular trivia tomorrow. Good luck on today's quiz. Question number one. The object of this game is to hold two or more cards that count as close to nine as possible. What is this casino card game 007's favorite? The answer is Baccarat. Question number two. Which month got its name from the Latin word that means to open, referring to the opening of buds on flowers and other spring plants? Here's a hint. The flowers are budding right now. The answer is April. Question number three, what is the name of the man depicted on the $50 bill who became U.S. President after the Civil War? The answer is Ulysses S. Grant. Question number four, both he and the Headless Horseman were in love with Katrina. What was the name of the main character in The Legend of Sleepy Hollow by Washington Irving? The answer is Ichabod Crane. Question number five, who was the Australian actor who starred in movies like 1933's In the Wake of the Bounty, 1935's Captain Blood, and 1938's The Adventures of Robin Hood? The answer is Errol Flynn. Question number six. A Spanish word that means table. What is the term used for a flat-topped mountain or hill that is usually a wide, flat, elevated landform with steep sides? The answer is a mesa. Question number seven. A sociological term from Tonga meaning forbidden, what is this term that describes a practice which is prohibited in a society? The answer is taboo. Question number eight, George, Elaine, Kramer, and Jerry end up in jail after having broken a good Samaritan law in the 1998 final episode of what American sitcom? The answer is Seinfeld. Question number nine. What was the title of the only Walt Disney classic film that has a title character that never speaks a single word during the movie? The answer is Dumbo. Question 10, what word as a verb means to shudder or tremble? and as a noun, can name the container in which an archer carries his arrows. That word is quiver. Question number 11. Describing the whole purpose of the game, 
What four word phrase is located throughout the Pokemon theme song and is repeated three times at the end of the song? The answer is gotta catch them all. Question number 12. In Scandinavian mythology, what is the name for the series of events and catastrophes that will ultimately lead to the end of the world? Specifically in Scandinavian mythology. The answer is Ragnarok. Question number 13. According to the ancient Greek legend, what was the name for the knot that was tied so tightly together that whoever was able to unravel it would become ruler of all Asia? The answer is the Gordian Knot. Question number 14. In the 1994 animated movie The Jungle Book, what is the name of the talking Black Panther who serves as friend and mentor to Mowgli? The answer is Bagheera. Question 15 in the 2004 animated movie Shrek 2. What is the name of the kingdom that's ruled by Fiona's parents? That is the kingdom of far, far away. Question number 16. What is the term for a unit of measurement named after an Italian scientist that measures potential energy across the terminals of a battery? Named for Alessandro Volta, it is a volt. Question number 17. When white light is dispersed by a prism into seven constituent colors, what color is in the middle of the spectrum between yellow and blue? The answer is green. Question number 18 in auto racing. What is the name for the ideal position in the front row on the inside of the first bend of the track that is given to the driver with the best time trial? That is called pole position. Question number 19, who is the only quarterback in the National Football League to have defeated Tom Brady in the Super Bowl twice. The answer is Eli Manning. And question 20, the Sphinx cat called Ted Nugent in real life was named Cat of the Year in 1999 primarily for playing what character in the Austin Powers movies? That would be Mr. Bigglesworth. All right, that is it for today. Thank you for watching today's episode of Road Trivia. We're back with the regular length trivia tomorrow. It'll be Day number 107 of the 365-day trivia road trip. Thank you guys for watching. Here is question 21, the tiebreaker for today's trivia quiz. Including states like North Dakota and South Carolina, how many total U.S. states have two word names? Looking for just the number.
there are 10 states with two word names, North Dakota, South Dakota, North Carolina, South Carolina, West Virginia, New Hampshire, New York, New Mexico, New Jersey, and Rhode Island. Whichever player got closest to that number wins the point. If it was a tiebreaker and you were all locked up before question 21, whoever got closest to the tiebreaker wins the point, wins the game. Congratulations. See you tomorrow to start another week of the 365-day trivia road trip.